Hello everyone. Welcome to Jira training. In this session, we will learn about Jira basic search. So as you know, any search is used to filter out the issues within within the tool. So in Jira as well, as you know, a Jira project is a combination or a collection of issues. An issue can be of type story, bug, uh, task, subtask, etc. So in order to search the issues within the project or within multiple projects, you need to have some filter or queries to, set, uh, to basically search the issues based on the criteria that you provide. So in order to fulfill that, Jira provides the basic search and advanced search facility. So in this session, we will learn about some of the basic search and, and uh, how you can use basic search to search for the issues. So before we actually go ahead and do the demo for the basic search, um, I'll try to cover some of the key elements of the search. So Jira query is made up of clauses, cl uh, single clause or multiple clauses. So an int and clause in turn is made of uh, field operator value and keyword so these elements field operator value and keywords um, i'll show once we navigate to the basic search so in order to navigate to the basic search uh, just go to the header at the top and click on the issues drop down and click on search for the issues right so that's the basic search page that gets opened up and here you see the drop downs. So, for example, project type, status, assignee, etc. These drop downs, these are the basic search um, uh, attributes or, or the clauses basically that you can select. All right. So now let's let's understand what exactly what are the elements of the clause and uh, how you can find uh, the the various elements of the clause within within the issue on this page so as as i mentioned a clause is made up of made up of uh, field operator value and keyword okay so field is something say for example summary if you see here summary is the field assignee is the field reporter is the field status priority all these are the all these attributes are the field okay then operator is any operator like equal to not equal to etc these are the operators so for example if i say assignee is equal to manish then assignee is the field equal to is the operator and manish is the value so in a clause you know we have field operator and value all right so field was assigned um, Field was um, assignee, operator was equal to, and value is my name, Manish. All right, so that makes a clause. Now, there is one more thing which which is part of the clause, which is the keyword. So the keywords are, uh, so Jira has six keywords altogether, and which are and, or, not, empty, null, and order by. Okay, so we'll cover these keywords in detail later but but just to give you a brief understanding so for example project all and then type all between that it's basically an and keyword okay so if i say project my sample project and then type as bug so that means my project is my sample project and issue type is bug so that means it will filter out the issues which which are part of the project my sample project and type as bug so internally if you see then there is a first clause which says project is equal to my sample project then there is a keyword and and then there is a second clause for the bug okay so that's that's how a simple you know like a basic query is made in jira okay so now let's let's understand some more examples so in order to 
do a new search you just need to reset this filter so just click on this new filter button here and it will reset the filter all right say so second example i want to search all the issues in my sample project which are of type story okay so how you will be able to search it so just go to the project drop down and select my sample project okay so the first criteria has been met you have selected a project as my sample project and the second thing you want to look for is the type should be story okay so i want to select i want to search the story or all the stories in my sample project okay so just select the story here so now the query will return all the issues which are of type story in project my sample project now you want to do another search reset the filter and you can start with another basic search so this is pretty much all about how you can do basic search in jira in further sessions we will learn about the advanced search and jql queries thank you